What's good everybody, Nate from Mass Collector here. I'm going through my next PSA submission I'm gonna do. This is number three for the Value Modern submissions. Um, I'm not gonna send it out until after Christmas with all the delays and packages that are being sent out. So um, just kinda wanna go through and put on another video first though. So, all right. I got gloves on because I just did a kind of parody of a video if you guys want to check it out it's a city crafting one um so i just left them on okay uh first one is dennis rodman force top's finest card uh next is Giannis. this is uh his second year prism card so it's 2014 And again, if this does get graded a 10, and that'd be great. If they did, it's probably gonna be worth more than that $200, $250 threshold, whatever value modern is. And they'll just charge me the extra. So if it ends up being a, you know, up to $500, whatever the, whatever the cost is, or they'll just add that on to my submission for this card. Uh, another Giannis. This is uh, 2015. Yep, 2015 Prism. Just, just the base. It's not the hollow. Uh, I have a Michael Jordan Upper Deck SP die cut All Star, 1996 All Star from San Antonio. This was such a dope. Um, Jersey that year so yeah 1996 that's when I pulled one when I was a kid same with this one this one here is the 1989 uh, hoop uh, sorry 1990 hoops but this is the Sears or JC Penney's um, hot stars or whatever it is so this is kind of like actually a gold looking bronze looking border instead of the silver that was the regular base cards that you get from retail so number 13 here's a jordan uh nuts and bolts from fleer metal this is a 95 96 and this is from my personal collection that I pulled when I was in college, it looks like. Yeah, 1996. Here is Jordan's 91-92 uh, Upper Deck base card. Um, this one here, I actually bought a bunch of Jordan... I'm um, sorry, I bought a bunch of upper deck wax boxes this year, 90, 91, 92. Um, like I bought like 10 boxes that I opened up and I got a bunch of these. But so you can see it, this is actually an 89, 90 picture because he's got Jordan 4s on. And the, the front picture, he's got 6s on. This is from the NBA Finals, I believe, this picture. The first year that he won the uh, first championship. Uh, I actually pulled this card out of a pack. This is a 90, 92 Tops, I believe. Tops Gold. Well, at least it's got the, the gold um, border here. Really, really nice, nicely centered too. It's been in really good condition. Yep, 92, 93 card. This is Shaq's rookie year. Uh, here is the uh, NBA hoops. USA basketball card, 92, Jordan. This is from my own collection. 
it's 91, 92. Um, here is Jordan's 91, 92 uh, award winner. He was the MVP that year. The hologram. And he's got the fours on. And of course, then he's got the sixes on here too. So, so weird that they got, what happened to the fives, you know? Pictures. Uh, here's Jordan's uh, East All-Star, 91-92. Upper deck. And we're gonna roll some really cheap base cards, but these are really nice condition. I, I bought a bunch of wax boxes of these two that I opened up this year. Uh, League Leaders, 91 Fleer. I have the All-Star Jordan. I have the Team Leaders Jordan. And this is pretty nice. There's not a lot of print coming off of it. It's pretty well centered. Uh, might be pushed down a little bit. But overall, you know, it's all about the edges and corners on these with all the print that goes out to the edge. Here's the base card. Very nice one. Might be a little soft corner up there, a little tiny white speck, but otherwise it looks really nice. This was the first the first series of basketball cards that had action photos on the back of the cards in color as well. Here is a upper deck all-star picture from San Antonio. Trying to find a year on it. 1998, 99. Uh, and then we're going to roll in some Rodmans. This is Rodman uh, Metal Universe from 90... 98. 97, 98 year. Um, I bought a lot of these this year. A lot of them. Love the car. Love the picture. The background's sick. And I'm a big Rodman fan, so... Here is a Topps Finest uh, Red Hollow or Silver or whatever you want to call it. Refractor. Uh, this is not numbered, but it's 2008, 2009. Maybe 2007. Topps is weird how they put the years on their cards. Uh, block Party, NBA Hoops, Dennis Rodman. Love this picture, especially with the green hair. This is from my own collection. So it's not the best. I mean, it's got some little white spots on it here and there, but I just love this card. So this is 95, 96. Skybox, NBA Hoops. And we have a LeBron 2015-16 hoops. You've seen this on my other submissions. I got more, I got a lot of these for the picture. Uh, here's LeBron's 2004 USA Fleer. I bought a bunch of these off of uh, Amazon actually before everything kind of went crazy. So I was getting these for about three, four dollars, five bucks a piece. Here is a Jordan Topps Chrome. Um, this is from 1999. And I bought this because I know the population is very, very low on this um, Jordan card, this Topps Chrome um, for 10s. I don't think it's gonna get a 10. It's got a little dimple up here. See that on there, and then it's not centered very well, but it's pretty close. Um, we'll see what I get on it. I think I paid 20 or 30 bucks for this card, but it's a cool, it's a cool card. 
Uh, we got a Griffey 1990 upper deck. So second year, this is a really, really nice card. Uh, if this doesn't come back a 10 or something wrong. Perfectly centered, almost on the back as well as the front. I have uh, Griffey's Rookie Fleer 89. You kind of see the, the edge is kind of scuffed up. Not scuffed up, but you know how it's clipped. It's, it looks like it's got some fraying on it. Uh, not perfectly centered, but I was just looking for cards to fill the submission to get over that 20, 30 card mark. Uh, here's another Griffey Jr. This is 91, 92 year. Um, up top to bottom, it's not very centered very well, but again, I just kind of wanted to get it slabbed. But I bought 10 boxes, no, five. I bought five boxes of this set this series, um, mainly to search for Jordan's SP1 card, the, the baseball card. And I actually pulled one out of five boxes. And the one I pulled is like perfect condition. I got a 10 on it from SGC. And then I got some Teddy Bridgewater. Um, this is a Topps Platinum rookie card. 2014. I bought a bunch of Teddy Bridgewater when he signed his contract with Carolina. Didn't have a great, great, great year, but I think he did okay. You know, it's a whole new team, basically. Coach, coaching staff, quarterback. And McCaffrey was pretty much hurt all year, too. So, But that's what I got for my third submission. I'm going to send this off um, after Christmas. Might send a couple off, so at the same time, just to save on shipping a little bit. But um, thanks for checking it out. Appreciate it. And uh, again, just kind of documenting this. It might take a long time to get them back, probably a year. But um, I've been sending stuff every couple weeks just to kind of get a flow going of all these cards that I've been buying up this year. So going to get some return back next year, hopefully. Appreciate it. Please subscribe if you haven't. Like the video and hit that bell for notifications. And we'll see you in the next video. Thanks.